What's up, party people? It's April the Sci-Fi Mombi, and welcome to another episode of Sci-Fi Mombi Found. What? So this is a show that kind of goes back into foods that I knew as a kid that I kind of still love as an adult. And, you know, they make it better. They build on it. New interesting flavors, new interesting products. So today's episode, since it's Easter and Bootsy's photobombing over my right shoulder, you say, hi, security guard Boots. He's like, no, screw you. <laughs> um, <clears throat> I'm doing my jar of che. Today's episode is about Peeps. Actually, it's all about the Just Born Candy Company, and they're a pretty interesting company. And so I made a slide. We'll start out with Peeps, and then we'll talk about Just Born. So hold, please. And here comes Boots. Wanting his 15 seconds of fame. And now he's going to knock up everything on my desk to get to my work laptop. Figures. And now he's just going to sit there. And now he's boots, <laughs> ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> now he's just boots. All right, here we go. Aren't they cute? Look at the little chicks. Oh, and by the way, I'm here too. Oh, yeah. Sorry. Let me bring in my co host, co host Vic. Hello. With me as always. Gee, Vic, what are we going to do today? <laughs> I don't know, but it looks like we have a whole bunch of stuff to try. No. The same thing we do every day, Vic. Try to take over the world. Or I try to take over the internet. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So. Sci-Fi Mobby Podcast is not endorsed, no sponsored by Peeps and the Just Born Candy Company. If you are curious about Peeps or the Just Born Company, please visit their websites at www.peepsbrand.com and www.justborn.com. All of the pictures and information obtained for this mini Mobby were obtained from their websites. Disclaimer! So, we all know about Peeps, right, Vic? Yep. Yippers. Those cute little bunnies and chicks and what's the other? Hold on. Bunnies and chicks and... They have another shape? I thought. I thought they said they had three shapes. All right. So when I'm looking up the food, I like to know where it came from. And I like those, the shows on history channel about, you know, how it was made and where it came from and yatta, 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 yatta. And so according to Wikipedia, which pulled a lot of their information from just born and peepsbrand.com peeps are introduced by just born, a candy manufacturer founded in Bethlehem, Pennsylvania by an immigrant from Venista in the Russian empire, Sam born. And he passed away in 1959. Wow. So he just made Peeps six years earlier and he passes away. Yeah. But look at when he was born. 1891. Yeah. Wow. That's insane. In 1953, Just Born acquired the Rhoda Candy Company and its marshmallow chick line. Sam's son, Bob Born, replaced the painstaking process of hand forming the chicks with mass production in 1954. When founder Sam Bourne displayed a sign for his freshly made candy, he titled it Just Bourne, playing off his last name and the fact that he made his candies fresh daily. According to Mary Bellis, the newly purchased company, Just Bourne, was soon the largest candy, sorry, the largest marshmallow candy manufacturer in the world. Wow. You know, I thought Tootsie Roll was because they make... Charleston Chew. Mm -hmm. But isn't Charleston Chew supposed to be nougat? Well, is it nougat or is it marshmallow? I thought it was nougat. You know, we're going to have a show on Tootsie Roll Company, so mm -hmm. maybe we'll we'll figure that out when we get there. What do you think? Mm -hmm. Yep, yep, yep. All right. All right, here I go. Mm -hmm. It's a hot day here, and I had a bust on side gigging, so yay. Just Born began producing other shapes in the 1960s following the seasonal themes. 
20 years later, the Marshmallow Peeps Bunny was released as a popular year-round shape of the candy. The yellow chicks were the original form of the candy, hence their name. But then the company introduced other colors and eventually the Myrad shapes that are now produced. So, oh, like, I think I figure out what the other one shape is. What? I think it's reindeer. No, that's Christmas. Yeah, but I think that's what the it's one of is. them. Like, there's stockings and pumpkins and ghosts uh, and stars for Fourth of July. So there's there's flags. So I believe there's, there's flags. So there's more than three. Shapes. Yeah, and then um, they've taken the original chick and made it bigger. And they dip the bottom of it in chocolate. Mm. And that's the delight line. And they have a new flavor called s'mores. And I couldn't find them. And I want to try the Rice Krispie Treat one. And we, yes. one we can't find those. We're going to have to order them online. But we have tried the Dr. Pepper one. Those are good. Yeah. I got the package for that here in a second. The only thing I have to say, though, is that they smell stronger than they taste. I like them. Well, well I, I do go. like them. I don't, mm. I don't have a problem with them. I just think they don't taste as strongly as Dr. Pepper as they smell like. I thought they did, but I'm a weirdo, so. Peeps were manufactured in different colors, such as lavender, starting in 1995 and blue in 1998. Prior to that, they were only being produced in the traditional colors of yellow, pink, and white. New flavors such as vanilla, strawberry, and chocolate were introduced between the years of 99 and 2002. And today, like I said, they have the delight line. They have the sour line. They have, let me show you, where did I put this seed? You sour line. Am I? Well, you're sharing your screen. Oh, that's right, Joy. Okay, well, I'll show you here in a few minutes. But yeah, they all all these different lines will show you. And that party cake. Yep. Kind of candy, lot. all kinds, yeah. Rice crispy treats. Yep. Fruit punch. Well, I needed a reminder about what peeps are made of. So according to www.peepsbrand.com and NBC Boston, because it looks like they did a story on it, making peeps only requires three ingredients, sugar, corn syrup, and gelatin. The chick's eyes are made from food grain carbono wax. Mm -hmm. So like spam, they're low ingredients. Not a lot of filler. Weird, fact, for the longest time, I thought the eyes were made out of chocolate. <laughs> I did too. I did too. Because, you know, they're brown. And it looks like chocolate. So, so according to some of the packages, the remaining 5% is food coloring... Yeah. And a little bit of artificial flavors. But most of the time, they try to put natural flavors in them. So, okay. And you would think there's some kind of preservative in it. To but there it. isn't. Really? No. Good. Wow. I think that's great. I want to try the sour strawberries. And look, they got a blue icy one. Oh, yeah. I so, think I saw that one. Well, I have a side gig in the other day. <laughs> I was like, how many varieties of Peeps are there? According to their website, there are 19 currently, but new flavors are always coming out like sour strawberry, icy blue raspberry, rice crispy treats, and like I said, the delight line. And Dr. Pepper. That's a new one too. It's not that new. It's newer. Yeah. So here you go. And the one that I was also trying to find right now, and see, they got this strawberry dipped one too that I really want to try. We have the wild berry ones right here. I think they're under the there's Yep. they're under all our mike yep and we got the sparkling wild berries we got a whole bunch of mike and ike's yep. too and they're they were hiding underneath the mike and the, the gingerbread ones are okay at christmas they have that gingerbread -y taste but the thing i also didn't show on here was there are so many products bearing the peeps name nail polish beauty stuff um shirts Bunny, they make their own bunny plushies now. I know that, they, and they're huge. They too. were huge at High V. I was like, man, I should buy one of those. I saw some at Walmart too. Yeah, and the candy. And also, mm -hmm. um, I, there's there's a flavor I wish they would make. What? Either a white chocolate delight mm -hmm. or a cookies and cream delight, where it's like dipped. Well, dipped. maybe you should go on their website and suggest it to them. Yeah. Maybe they'll watch our program. Sure. <laughs> you never know who's watching. I mean, Bianca Del Rio liked our uh, tweet, so. That's uh, right. That's right. Um, this is the one I was really looking for is these. They are the Peeps on a Stick. 
for oh. Easter. And then this one right here, the total chocolate dipped. Oh my God, those are simple. Mm -hmm. Simple. Or but I think what they should do as well is make a strawberry and chocolate dipped one. It's right here. Oh. Well, they no, are get no, what I mean is like straw dipping in like strawberry flavored white chocolate oh, and then oh, regular, oh. and then milk chocolate. I get you. Yeah. But right here, these are your originals. So it's like a chocolate covered strawberry flavor. Yeah. Well, I used to get peeps every Easter in my Easter mm -hmm. basket from Nana and Papa and Whoppers. Yeah. <laughs> Those were the two staples. And then we got like a solid chocolate bunny. Mm -hmm. So these have always been a part of my life in some form. Of course, my husband always thought I was weird because I liked peeps. Peeps are good though. And he likes them now. <laughs> they grow on you. Is that a candy cane flavor? Oh, let me go back. Yes, they have this one, and then they have the chocolate dipped one in the delights. Oh wow, it's very, very good, very good. So give peeps another try. They're really good. What's the green one? Which one? This one, trees. Oh, cool. See, here's the stockings and the skulls. They have. They're down here. They have ghosts and pumpkins and uh, Frankenstein and they got trees and snowmen and the gingerbread men are really good. I like that gingerbread Maybe they flavor. Maybe make like a caramel apple flavored one for Halloween Ooh, too. That's a good, yeah. for fall in general. Yeah. Yeah. I think they make a pumpkin flavored one. Mm. I think it's the pumpkins, but I can't remember. Figures. So a little bit about the Just Born Candy Company. They were founded in 1923 by Sam Bourne. Um, they are a third generation family owned candy company. This is off their website, by the way. Um, and they have four iconic brands of candy. Peeps, Mike and Ike's, Hot Tamales, and Goldenberg's Peanut Chews, which I cannot find anywhere, so I'll have to order them in. They sound good, though. I know. And it, you know what? When you look at the pictures, here, let me show you. Oh, I didn't grab the one where it shows the cutout, but it looks like it's a rival to the Snickers bar. It looks like they have three different kinds, too. Yeah, it looks like original, dark, milk chocolate, and retro. I don't know what retro means, but that looks like it's original packaging. Yeah. Yeah. Or maybe it's like the original formula, too. Maybe they changed it over the years. And that's the yeah. Original. Yeah. You know, like Coke. Yeah. <laughs> or new Coke. <laughs> new Coke. What Coke? I don't know. Coke, Coke. All right. Um. So just born. Crystal Pepsi. <laughs> right now. Okay, I better not sing that. That's a copyright they, violation. Did they actually, show tomorrow? Did they ever make a clear Coke? Mm -mm. Mm. Yeah, Coke wouldn't do that. <laughs> so of course SNL had to spoof Crystal Pepsi with Crystal Gravy. Yep. It's like <laughs> I tried Crystal Pepsi when it came back. Mm -hmm. And it tastes like Pepsi, but you can tell something's off. Yeah, it's mis like the caramel coloring is what sometimes gives it the flavor. Yeah. yeah, exactly. So Just Born is 100 years old. Congratulations, guys. They bought a candy company, like I said earlier, and that's how they acquired Peeps. And Peeps used to be handmade. But in 1954, the sun turned it into automation. But... Like we said, Hot Tamales, Mike and Ike's, and Goldenberg's Peanut Chews are all a part of the Just Born Candies. And I don't, do you know what? I don't think I could ever imagine life without a Just Born product. I know I've bought it for you guys for years, for your Easter, Christmas, whatever. You guys like them. Yeah, Peeps and uh -huh. Mike and Ike. So Mike and Ike's has branched out to a lot of different flavors. And we couldn't find some of them either. We have we have a good selection, but we couldn't find all of all of those either. Yeah, and I didn't even think about picking up a bag of hot tamales, but you know they have not changed at all. They're the same. They're just spicy cinnamon candy. Spicy cinnamon candy. So, all right. So. We're going to try them. And this has been a sci-fi mommy found what? The slideshow presentation. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so what do you want to start out with, Vic? Um, okay, so first of all, Dr. Are, Pepper. Yeah, those are good. Yeah, these are good. 
Fruit punch is not bad. It just needs more flavor. It tastes kind of like uh, Kool-Aid, though. Just like Kool-Aid. It does taste, yeah. It, but or, that one's called Tropical Punch, not Fruit Punch. So, the no, the oh, Kool-Aid. I thought this tasted like Crystal Light Fruit Punch. Ah. Which is same company, but different brand. I've tried a lot of different Fruit Punch flavors. I think <laughs> my favorites are... I think doesn't snap a lot of fruit punch. God, you have to ask me that. Because I think they do. I've tried that one. I liked it. I've had the Arizona one. That one was pretty good. The so what Brit. are we starting with? It didn't one. buy five. Not about five packages. What else did you get? Or did you get? Don't you love it when you think you buy something and you can't find it? No, I guess I only bought four. What's that up? There, that's the bag. Is that a bag? Up by your monitor. Up by my monitor. Are those bags of chips? Those are, my, yeah, those are my, I, I might be doing a thing on Quest. Yeah, they have, they have this stuff. Too. Because, as you all know, I had gastric sleeve surgery, so I have to eat high protein, at least 60 to 80 grams of protein a day. And this is one of the best ways I've found to get because they're almost 20 grams of protein by themselves in the bag and they taste really good and too. one bag is 140 calories i mean these are look at this flavor and they're really good too they taste just like yum they, just, they taste exactly like they regular don't, doritos they're not made i don't think they're made of whey protein what kind is that okay maybe they have whey protein this is uh, uh cheddar and sour cream yeah and a lot of them they taste like they, they have whey really protein good. in it but it's more of a Okay, maybe it is all whey protein. To me, it doesn't taste like it. But they also have like pizza. I think they have protein. They have bars shakes. Too. They have protein bars. They like have protein cookies. I think cookies, candies. They sell their their powder protein powders in huge tubs that are the flavors of their bars. I I, I have nothing bad to say about Quest. And see, they're actually, but I love Premier Protein. Yeah. But they're also one of the only protein. Uh, food makers that make a uh, savory option that is true yeah premier, premier doesn't do a lot of savory options yeah. or really any at all so which one are we starting with first are we going sour or are we going what let's start with the wild berry all right you have it in your hand. Hand. Wild berry. nor my fingernails <laughs> yeah never mind mm. all right so one package is four bunnies, and they're 130 calories. And I know y'all don't want to hear this on Easter, but you know, I'm kind of conscious about calories. So, all right. Woo, you smell them? Oh, wow. Those are strong. Aren't they cute? Apparently, they're sparkling wild. Bunnies, bunnies. I wonder what makes them sparkling. I think they got pop candy on them. Oh, yeah. I think it's pop rocks. All right, here we go. Ready? Mm-hmm. Mm. Yeah, they're really good. Dude, these are like the flavor like explodes in your mouth on these. Wow. Mm. I mean it's artificially flavored, but it's not that bad. Mm-hmm. Yeah. <laughs> Did you ever play with them as a kid? <laughs> My cousins and I used to like to take them and shove them all in our mouth and go, Toby Bunny. <laughs> Toby Bunny. All right. What's next? Well, I think since you have it, let's just see. All right. Cotton candy. Okay. So this one is five chicks for the same amount of calories. Hmm. Why is it any different? I think it's because the chicks are a little smaller. They're than not. Oh, they're the these are These are bigger. Oh. These are bigger than, or maybe they're the same size. I don't know. All I know is it tastes good. Well, I don't know. I haven't tried these yet. This is my first time trying these. 
think we should also do a video on Zevia sodas too. Yeah, we'll do. We can do. You know, whatever we find. Yeah. They got the little crunchy thingies on it too. Uh -huh. Yoink. <laughs> Might split the last one in half. What do you say? Mm -hmm. We should have cleansed our palate before we started on the cotton candy. Well, I did a little bit. I don't care. It's, you're, you're too much fun. Wow. Yeah. Hmm. I think the texture of the sugar kind of makes it. It's definitely got that flavor. Mm-hmm. I think it's the texture of the sugar that kind of makes it a little off, but it's pretty good. Yeah, but that's what cotton candy is, though. It's yeah. that texture. Mm-hmm. Ooh, that smells like cotton candy, too. <laughs> mm-hmm. Now, mm. yeah. will I buy them again? If I'm desperate for some candy, maybe. <laughs> right. What's next? I say we save the party cake for last. All right. May I cleanse my palate first, please? Yeah. Pay no attention to the bottle in my hand. <laughs> probably should have done water, Joe. Yeah, we probably Ugh, Diet Coke and beefs do not go together. <laughs> oh god, that's nasty. <laughs> oh. Hold on. Woo. That was bad. Yeah. That was bad. That was real. Dude, I used to do that all the time though. I used to eat peeps and drink a Diet Coke. I was like, I guess that's the original flavor. Yeah, because it was just it was just regular marshmallow, regular peeps. So with sugar. Oh god. It's weird though, because you can find all the different flavors of peeps, but you can hardly find the original peeps anymore. You have to buy them like right at the beginning when they start selling Easter candy. Ah. To get a hold of them. I've noticed. I hate sour. I don't like sour. So it's we're gonna see where this sour goes. Sour watermelon. Blech. I want a sour strawberry. I could tolerate that. I don't like artificial watermelon. Same. So Five chicks, 130 calories. I don't usually like artificial watermelon, so we'll see how this goes. Yeah, artificial watermelon has a strange... This doesn't say that it's artificial, though. Wow. It smells artificial. That smell, yeah. It's it's that artificial water, water minute. Water. Or what they call artifi artificial water. Oh, look. It's pink on the inside. Pink That's cool. On the inside. It, they call it watermelon, but it doesn't smell or taste like watermelon to me. Wow. This is probably. You, oh, you tear them apart and they're already bleeding. <laughs> look at them. Oh, that's not that bad. <laughs> A little sour, but it's not that Yoink. bad. Oh, dude. What? It's sour. Woo. It's not that bad to me. It is to me. <laughs> it's in the sugar. It's not, it's the not in the marshmallow. You want the last one? All right. It's not even that bad to me, but okay. You know, I don't like sour things. It's really... It's really affecting me. And I'm going to eat this last one because I'm a weirdo. All right. I think I'm just used to sour stuff. You guys like sour candy. I don't. So. You guys like Sour Patch Kids and. um. I like sour Skittles too. Yeah. I'm dying. I'm dying. Mm. 
not my forte, but if you like it, go for it. <laughs> Hi, buddy. Hi, boo. And security guard. No, Boots. look, he, he never hops up on me. Look Captain Boots has come. Here he, he comes. He never hops up on, on me and he just hopped up on me. Let's say hi to everybody. So. Here. Hello, I'm on patrol. Mama, why are you doing this? Yes. <laughs> I'm a good boy. I got a new little sister. Oh no, niece, and her name is Socks, and she looks just like me, except she's got white hair on her chin, chinny chin chin, and it makes her look like she's got some fangs. Well, she, I think she has a bit more white. Going and she's got white chest all down her belly. Yeah, he's like, Mama, let me go. Stop it, Mom. He's like, after right, you put that <laughs> Twilight Zone shit on me, I don't want to deal with it anymore. <laughs> You're going to see his tail. There it goes. Hey. <laughs> All right. Last but not least. Party time. Party time. P-A-R-T-Y. Because we got <laughs> All right. And then we'll move into Mike and Ike's. Still sitting there in the back of my throat. I don't know how it was that sour <laughs> to you. It wasn't that bad to me. Same amount of chicks for the same amount of calories. And there goes Boots. Bye-bye, Bootsy. He's waiting for me to clean off my work computer so he can sit on it. And he knows he's not supposed to sit on it. He's Are like, you boots? I was like, well, I'm going to do boots. it anyway. Don't you do it. Okay. They are yellow. It looks kind of like cake. <laughs> Oop, I'm flipping the camera off. <laughs> looks like, it looks like cake batter. They look like cake batter. Yep. <laughs> With sprinkles. And now the peeps are flipping the camera off. And they're just, you know, yellow. You mean I'm flipping the camera off? Okay. They smell like cake. Boots. <laughs> Kids. You know what? Get it. <laughs> 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 no, let me spit it out. <laughs> mm -mm. This is not for me. You want the last one? Yeah. I love peach. Oh, you know what? We should microwave it and see what happens. <laughs> People do that. I'm not kidding. People microwave their peeps. Or maybe we could get some some of the more interesting peach flavors and make rice krispie treats out of them. Mm. Or we take or if we could find the rice krispie treat peeps, we melt we melt those down and make those into rice krispie treats. Hey, I'm game. I like rice krispie treats. I'm always trying to find you know yeah. another another thing of me besides trying to find the high protein stuff, and now I'm going to go into a sugar coma <laughs> is because I always want to take recipes. Maybe I'll start a cooking show on that. I don't know. I don't know. But I always want to take old recipes and make them high protein. So, what do you think? <clears throat> yeah. All right. So, that concludes our peeps segment of the show. Um, so, we're going to move into it. Mike and I. And that was the original. They have all kinds. Mm -hmm. This one is a shock to me. Grape flavor. I never thought they'd come up with a grape flavor. Okay. All right. So we're going to start with original. This is a lot of sugar. I know. I'm going to be hyper all afternoon on Easter. All right. So the original Mike and Ike's, you can have 16 pieces for 110 calories. They are cherry, lemon, strawberry, lime, and one let me give you and the box is still hard to open even after 40 years 
for however long I've been eating them. All right, what are you trying first? Um, lemon to get it out of the way. Yes, lemon. Eh, subtle. Mm -hmm. That's not like... Well, we did just eat a whole bunch of peeps, so... Right? <laughs> it's not a punch you in the face taste, you know? Mm -hmm. Okay. What are you eating? Orange? That one looks funny. I'll show you. <laughs> it looks like a deer plug. It looks like Weird. one of those. It looks like one of those uh, ear plugs. Mm-hmm. That right, was next. Uh, lime. Yeah. The orange is a little bit more. So what's the pink one supposed to be? Um, strawberry. Okay, we're saving that to last. Because strawberry is my favorite flavor. My favorite. Oh, lime's okay. So cherry next. Is that the right one? Mm-hmm. Cherry. I'm going to drop it in the floor. Drop it like it's hot. It's basically the same flavors that are in Skittles. If you think about it. But don't they... Isn't there green, green no, I apple? Think they, I think they brought back... Did mine. they bring it back? Yeah. yeah. Bring it back, y'all. Bring it back down tonight. Okay. Strawberry? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. It's all like right. That. I like that. All right. <clears throat> all right. That's original. We'll eat all those later. <laughs> it was very original. Very original. Where do you want to go next? Um, we got this one's got strawberry, raspberry, watermelon, cherry, and fruit punch. Let's we'll say that last. Okay. Jolly Joe's is straight grape. Let's do grape. Do grape? Yeah. <laughs> 16 pieces for 110 calories, y'all. And once again, I can't get the box open. Here, let me try. Or you can do that. Yeah, okay, let's try five different ones to see if they all taste like that. <laughs> great. Okay, hold still. <laughs> 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 Just shove them all in your mouth. Oh, fire the one. Like, mm. okay. I'm not the grape flavor I was expecting. It's like grape medicine. Mm hmm. Ladies and gentlemen, Diamond Tap. <laughs> I'm kidding. <laughs> what? I'm kidding. What do you mean? I said Dimatap. Hmm. What? Oh. Dimatap has that great flavor. Mm. Are you using my Quest chips as a pillow? Hmm? Ignore my messy desk. Kids. All right. Which one's next? Victor. Um, Tropical or berry? Let's do tropical. Okay. Tropical. Thai food is oops, nice backwards. Kiwi banana, Caribbean punch, strawberry banana, paradise punch, and mango. Two of the flavors are punch. <laughs> Let's see. Once again, 16 pieces for 110 dollars. At least they're being consistent on that. Hold your hand out. Okay. 
didn't get any greens. Oh, I gave you a mango. What the heck? <laughs> really? I need a bowl. Can you grab me a bowl? All right. All right, there. Oh, yeah, there's stuff in the thing. Oh, let's just use Yeah, it. let's use that. That'll work. Shove all these back in. Look at this. Okay, guys. Wish I had an overhead camera. They do this sometimes. This is outrageous. Okay, so out of this whole box, two greens. Well, that's perfect because we only need two. And then what's the other? And, of course, I dropped the box. All right, so you've got green. Is there a yellow one? Or what's the other color? Okay, green, blue, dark red, paradise punch. There you go. Do the, do the kiwi first. It's really good. I like it. And then do paradise punch. Mm. Which one's paradise punch? The pink, pink one. Oh. Yeah. I like that kiwi. That's the shit that they don't put enough in there. Mm -hmm. Watch, there's a box that's just all kiwi banana. <laughs> Isn't that the bomb? All right, Paradise Punch. Yeah. Mm. 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 Oh, wait. <laughs> no. <laughs> Once you chew it enough, you get the pineapple and you get the mm -hmm. citrus aftertaste. All right. Uh, strawberry banana. The darker pink. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I'm not impressed by that. Mango? What's the blue one supposed to be? Uh, Caribbean punch. It looks like toothpaste. <laughs> hmm. It tastes like toothpaste, too. <laughs> it's got like a mango or a passion fruit undertone. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Not bad. Yeah, show, show one of the Caribbean. It looks like toothpaste. Well, he says it looks like toothpaste. It does kind of look like toothpaste, though. Oh, I like that mango. Mm -hmm. Ooh. Yummy. That, um, that's good. I'm a good neighbor. And ladies and gentlemen, sci-fi mommy spills everything. I'm spilling the candy. I'm spilling the beans. Mm. All right, that's the tropical fusion. Right? Typhoon. Sorry. Tropical typhoon. That would be fun just to like mix those all up into one thing. Yeah. All right. Red or berry? We'll do berry next because we're no. Yeah, because we're saving the red for last. So, wild berry, blue raspberry, strawberry, blueberry, and peach berry. Peaches are not a berry. Actually, they are. Shut up. Berries are fruits that have the seeds on the No, inside. that's a stone fruit because it has a... But it's also a berry because berries berries are fruits. That cherries, are cherry is a stone fruit because yeah. it has the big old pit. Well, berries are just fruits that have the seeds inside of them. So most fruits are berries. Blue. Uh-oh. This is a blue rat. I bet there's not a lot of blue raspberries in here. <clears throat> nope, there isn't. And blue raspberry. So, which one are you doing first? Purple. Wild berry. Ow. It's okay. Which one now? A strawberry. We're gonna try that one. Let's try it again. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Right. What's next? So is the brighter blue the blue raspberry? Let's, mm -hmm. What's this one? That's blueberry. All right, let's do blueberry. Okay. Blueberry. 
I feel like there aren't that many blueberry candies. Mm -mm. Where is that? Yeah. Mm. Yeah. Pleasantly surprised by this one. Pretty good. Mm hmm. All right, what's next? Now let's do blue raspberry. And then peach? Yeah. Okay. Toothpaste color. <laughs> <laughs> Eh. Yeah. That's blue raspberry. Oh. Blue, yeah, blue raspberry. Well, yeah, I don't even sour. Oh, my. It's not that sour. <laughs> the my taste buds are fun. <laughs> okay. That one must have, like, more in it than it should have. Yeah. Um, blue raspberry is another one of my favorite candy flavors. My. <laughs> <laughs> This is what happens when you eat Mike and Ike's. <laughs> yeah. Well, my favorite blue raspberry flavor candy will always be Jolly Ranchers. Jolly Ranchers are so And that's good. also the only Jolly Rancher I actually like. And that is a part of the Hershey Company, which we will look at. Mm -hmm. Peach berry. Okay, I'm waiting for flavor. <laughs> okay, I finally got it. <laughs> I got it right away. I didn't. Must have been the beginning of the lot in production. Sometimes when you get the beginning and you don't get that much flavor. Let's see if I can find another one. Hmm. Still not good enough. <laughs> Gotta work on that one, boys. <laughs> Girls. People. Party people. All right. Last but not least. And that is. Red radius. Strawberry, raspberry, watermelon, cherry, and fruit punch. And same amount of calories uh, per pieces. So at least they're being consistent. <laughs> oh my god don't look at me that way <laughs> stop looking at me swan <laughs> just tap it in all right they're all red jim they're all red <laughs> they're kind of stuck to they're, they're dead kind of dave they're all dead dave them. they're all dead dave all right there we go okay we all know strawberry raspberry yep it's the same strawberry different from blue raspberry i hope what is the difference in blue raspberry and raspberry yeah the tartness and the sour even though blue raspberry isn't a real thing right Watermelon. Watermelon. this. That's a movie we should watch together. The Birdcage. I love Robin Williams and Nathan Lane. Mm -hmm. mm. See, I don't like artificial watermelon, so. Well, I don't it's know. It's a lot bolder than the peeps. Yeah. Okay. But I don't know who tried it. I don't know who tried artificial watermelon said it. Yep, that's watermelon. Because <laughs> if you've ever tried a watermelon, it does not taste like that. Cherry. Who knows? Maybe it's like a banana. Maybe you have to freeze it for it to taste like it's artificial variant. What is this one? Cherry? Mm. I think this is fruit punch. I think. How did how did you how did you not taste the sour on that cherry? I have no idea. Because that one had a bit of sourness. Was that fruit punch? It must have yeah. It kind of tastes like fruit punch. Try this one. Of course they're all red, so I can't figure it out. <laughs> 
this is what happens when you're all <laughs> Well, at least when you open up a Starburst bag of all reds, you know what the hell they are. <laughs> oh, you know what we didn't get for our nerd? What? We didn't get a nurse rope. You know, I went to Dollar General and I had a couple nerds ropes in my hand. And when I couldn't find any more peeps, I was like, man, screw this. I'm out of here. <laughs> so I should have brought, I should have bought them. Wah! And now it's another installment of Sci-Fi Mommy drops everything. In the style of Peter Griffin. <laughs> <laughs> you and I are. I feel like that's what Peter Griffin does. He either drops stuff or he hurts his knee. <laughs> or that one time where Lois Lois hurts her boobs. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> and it's the same. <laughs> yeah. Done that before. Does not feel good. All right. So, that's the Just Born Candy Company. If we find the peanut cluster, peanut, what are they called? Peanut chews. Peanut chews. And also, if we find those Rice crispy Treat Peeps and the yeah. icy ones, we will do a supplement. Mm hmm. And we will come on and we will taste test them for you. Um, we will try not to gain weight when we do all the taste testing. But our next episode, oh, let's not use that one because it's shitty. We're going to talk Wonka candy. But they're not really Wonka candy anymore. They are owned by something I can't read. Because it's too small. Let me see it. Let's see. It's right there. I just can't see it. Let me, I might be able to. Ferrero. Ah. You know, the company that makes those deliciously awesome Ferrero Rochers. And they also make um, bad butter fingers now. <laughs> Actually, they went back to the original flavor oh, of butter finger. They took over all of Nessie's candy company. So... And none of the actual Wonka branded candies have come back. So, so I think the only Wonka branded candy no. that we have now is the top hats. Um, gummies. Oh yeah, I need to buy one of those. Um no, the chocolate bars are still around. No, I mean like the sprees and runs and Yeah, I couldn't find a box of gobstoppers. Or yeah, gobstoppers either. Like No sprees are still around. I've seen them. What about runs? Hold, please. I used to love the banana runs. I love it. I love runs all around. Runs and sprees. Runs and sprees. I like chewy sprees. Oh, they say Dollar Tree has them, but they didn't have them. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they say they're still out there. Huh. Do they make runs anymore? Yes. Chewy runs. Yummy. There's chewy runs. There's chewy runs. There's chewy sprees. I don't believe there's chewy gobstoppers anymore. Yeah, that wouldn't make sense because they're supposed to be. Uh, yeah, they're supposed to be. Yeah. I think we can buy them in bulk from Ferrera. But how much is that gonna cost? I don't know. Let's go look. I remember when they used to have the. Buy uh, now. I remember when they used to have those Wonka candy machines in the movie theaters. You know, you take a little cup, you put it under there, you choose Oh, you wow. They won't even let me buy it. Oh, wait, it says buy online. <clears throat> hey, April, it helps if you read the website. Well, look at this. They make Fun Dip. Yeah. They make Lemon Head. Mm -hmm. Wow. Look at all Bob's. Apple Head. Yeah. Oh, my God. I have more I have to go buy. Well, I remember. You remember those? Uh, Juicy Monka, Fruit. You remember those? Juju Beads. They make Juju Beads. Mom. Yeah, I'm, I'm mom. <laughs> mom B. What? Remember when they used to have those Wonka candy machines at the movie theaters? Yeah. You take a little cup. You See? Chewy you choose, And you choose which candies you want. Mm hmm I miss those. I have never tried a Wonka bar. They make one for Christmas. What? Called Snowballs. Gobstopper Snowballs. Wow. I've never tried a Wonka bar. They before. make fruit striped gum. Wow. Holy shiznit. They make super bubble. I like juicy fruit gum. Wow. That's going to be a huge one for Ferrero. We're going to have to go through. Mm -hmm. 
fish. I've never tried a Wonka bar in my life. Oh my God, are you serious? I'm serious. Wow. So, all right, well, that wraps up our Just Born Candy Company peeps and at least we did Mike and Ike's. Um, you should they, show the messed up bag of nerds anyway. <laughs> look at what they did to our bag of nerds. It's, it's off in production. Yeah, look at the back. You yeah, can't even see, read look. the ingredients or yeah, nutrition it. facts. See. Yeah. yeah, but look at the back too. <laughs> All right, we're not going to taste test those today. I'm on a sugar high. Yeah. We need real, we need real food. We need real food. <laughs> All right, well, we had a great time. And join us next time when we talk. Well, it, it's going to be Wonka Candy, but it's owned by the Ferrera Candy Company. And they don't even do the chocolate part. Who does the Wonka bar? We'll have to, we'll have to report on that next time. All right. What's weird is Nestle is it's just gone in America. In other countries, it's they, still around. Yeah. Yeah. Well, they they were losing the candy war. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Party on, Victor. Party on, Mommy. Later, party people. <laughs>